guys it's exciting time at farming on the rock so how are you doing if you're new here my name is marie and this is my container garden i currently have a lower section and i have a, an upper section so a lot of changes are taking place at the upper section now i also have some new plants that i'm trying for the first time and they're starting to produce so i am super excited and i'm going to share that with you also so this is a sort of update video as well as just showing you some changes that are taking place in my garden both with the plants that are in here and also with the infrastructure the layout of the garden so come along with me guys let me show you what is happening my husband is up top working so i'm going to take you there and show you what he's doing now and then i basically give you an idea as to what the plan is moving forward all right guys thank you so much for joining me i appreciate you so so much let's go up top Guys, if you thought those two looked good, check out this first class one. Baby, you're a genius. You know, nobody never tell you that before. Yeah. Oh. Me. You tell yourself? Yeah. Then that makes sense. Of course. Guys, this is awesome. Self-confidence. Of course. And you rightfully should have self-confidence because you're brilliant. This is going to be so beautiful. Oh man. I'm going to abandon the rest of the garden. I'm just going to live up here. Do that again. Do that again. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. The bird am I, teaching, you know? I think so. Are you a teacher bird? This is, this is going to be beautiful. Mm, my gosh. Michael, who fix your clothes? You look like Grandpa Dreyfus. <laughs> Where are you going? Guys, you see the terrain and look at that little man. Just look at him go. Now if him roll, we are gully now. No man, but seriously guys, this looks so good. Look at that. I'm a, I, I can't have my breakfast right here. You know? Just sit down amongst my, my, my veggies and flowers. Guys, this is awesome. What do you think guys? It's going to look so good. So, so good. I can't wait to utilize that one. You need to come out of the sun. Look at you go. Just look at you go. Where did you go? <laughs> He's going to say, Mommy, go in. So I'm going to leave him. I'm going to leave him alone so he can work. Several moments later. <laughs> Guys, I'm just feeling too happy today. All right, so he has completed the boarding up. And I did the steel work. And this afternoon we'll be pouring that. But I won't, I won't take you through all of that. I'll just give you an update as to where we go next and the next time you see this section you'll be seeing plants on my new stand all right so over here here we had a lovely little bed you might recall me and my dad planted some sweet potatoes and we had a black cocoa in it it was the hardest thing for me to do but i had to pull up those because it was in my way of my new um plant stand here so i had to 
take out those and I'll be show you where I've relocated them in a little bit and um, it was not easy making that decision and when I pull up those slips I would have gotten about seven sweet potato from one I, I, I'm not sure how to tell him that I dug up everything that we planted but I relocated it and I think it should be fine where it is now so yes this is this, the, the garden is a mess now, but I need to show you the mess before I show you the vast improvement. Alright, let me show you where I relocated my sweet potato slips. Okay, so right here was where the bed was. And you see, I literally built it on rocks, guys. And here I am storing my soil here because I'm going to reuse them. It look a mess now, but trust me, guys, it's going to be beautiful. You got to trust your girl. It's going to be beautiful all right so over here let me back up so you can see so this is the area that we're going to work on in the afternoon and here is my bed that I had only corns growing in so I place the sweet potatoes in there no and they look a bit sad but they will bounce back fingers crossed guys they will bounce back and the black cocoa plant that you saw in that sweet potato this is one of the machine in a machine containers this is the fourth one and I planted my cocoa plant here my black cocoa so I think my dad will still be happy when he comes and see that there because it it is doing fantastic in its huge tub hope to get some nice cocoa from that plant so yes guys that is it for my sweet potato i had to say bye bye to that bed in order to facilitate my new my new um plant stand right here all right so now i'm going to take you down the bottom oh i have one or a couple of plants here that are new I can show you before I actually go down to the one that I am most excited about. So this pepper I'm going for the first time. And it is a, I have a label guys. Be proud of me. This is the serrano pepper I'm planting. And it is starting to, to blossom guys. Can you see that? This, forgive me I lost the label. I think it might be. It's a tomato. I'm not calling it. I don't know which one it is. And this is my black beauty eggplant. Also, it started to produce. Can you see the bosoms in there? So that is awesome. Now this tomato over here, I believe this is the... Hmm. I think this is a Cherokee purple. If it's not, it's a beefsteak. It's one of the two. It is also putting on buds so that is awesome that is incredible I am so so happy about that one so so happy now guys I am happy and disappointed at the same time with this one I'm not sure if you can see what is going on here but there are lovely banana peppers growing on this plant I purchased bell pepper pack mix bell pepper i planted them away from the garden in containers inside on my balcony and i still got banana pepper help i need help now i have four pepper plants around here this one is the only one that i'm seeing a pepper on the others have just blossoms guys help me to pray that at least two of them are bell peppers help i love you but i needed my bell pepper let's move on guys this here is the lower section of the garden all of down here not much is being done yet because this is the most productive part of the garden at the minute and we really don't want to move the plants and while they're producing but i have something right there that i need to show you I planted a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin right there and yesterday well usually I check 
while I'm watering to see if anything is being eaten by a pest, if there are any new growth, any new fruits. And so I was checking and guess what I saw, guys? I won't tell you. Let me just show you what I saw in here. Someone shout from the back of the class and tell teacher what that is right there. Can you see that right there? Can you see it? I am so happy. I'm so thrilled. I cannot believe it. That's my first little jack-o'-lantern pumpkin. I'm so looking forward to it. I am looking forward to it. I need to eat this. <laughs> this actually. I need to eat that. Oh, let me show you what is happening with the ginger that I just planted. They're coming up just, just fine. This ginger has made me so proud. I'm going to take out all of these corns. But let me just walk you through the garden and show you what I need to show you. All right, I need your help, guys. I asked in my last video. I'm not sure if anyone has answered me yet. These cabbages are looking so good, guys. They're starting to form their little heads. Can you see that? Can I eat this peas? Let me know, please. Can I eat that peas? I really want to taste what that peas tastes like. And the rain is coming. It's coming down again. So let me hurry up and show you. Can you see sugar cane right there? Mm-hmm. Yes. I'm seeing sugar cane right there. Oh, yes. It's about to rain and wet me up. Can you see the rain? Let me stop fooling around and move along. Guys, I want you to take a look over here. This is my another black beauty eggplant. But look at this beauty. What are those guys? Those are tomatillos coming on. I can't wait to make my homemade salsa, guys. I've only eaten that at the hotel, I think. Never made it. But the recipe looks fairly easy, so I am going to make it. Alright, so that's basically, it's just a quick video guys, just showing you what I'm excited about. Because I know some of you are excited about the same sort of stuff. Hold on, I, this is supposed to be a cherry tomato. And it is putting on blossoms as well. Yay! Oh yay! Oh, beautiful. Guys, Rena, go whip me up out here. Here's another volunteer yam skin growing. I'm going to take it out and put it in one of my containers. This is a yam, yellow yam growing right there. Guys, look at these red callaloo. I just replanted these. Like literally a couple of days. Not weeks. Days that I've replanted these. How beautiful are those? Oh my word, I need to run out of the rain. The rain is coming. The rain is coming. It is coming. Look at my. These are my cucumbers. Just planted them a couple of days. I'm going to back up out of the rain. And let you enjoy a little bit of it. A little bit of the rain. Look at that. It's a blessing. I'm sure my garden is going to be so, so happy absolutely happy ha oh yes here come the rain again guys i am so happy i am so happy my husband made me happy so proud guys i want to thank the persons who have been giving me seeds thank you guys oh yes i need to remind you that I am planning on having a weekly, and I think we've decided on Wednesdays to feature persons who have started garden just by watching my channel. And even if, if that's not the case and you want to just share your garden with me, you can go ahead and send short 30, to 30 seconds to one minute videos or just photographs. Send them to my email or to my Instagram and i will feature you on a wednesday when i big up those persons who are getting their hands
30 to feed themselves and their families if you have one tomato plant growing i have a few emails already and I, even if i get one person i will still be doing the feature and also to encourage others to share what they're growing to eat and what they're doing to help feed their families healthy all right guys if you're watching and you've not yet subscribed please go ahead and press that subscribe button and also the notification bell so when i post another video you will be notified all right please like and leave your comments your questions your concerns your recommendations i will get back to you even if not immediately i will get back to you within 24 hours all right guys thank you so so much please share my videos take care now i'm gonna enjoy the rain bye bye guys bye